What is the coolest thing about Pluto? It's temperature. That was easy. For me, it's that it's a planet out there far from the sun, small, but has moons of its own, and also the fact that my daughter did her fourth grade project on Pluto. Pluto has glaciers that appear to be flowing. There may even be ice volcanoes on it. And Pluto is a tiny little body. It really should have lost all of its heat a long time ago. It's nowhere near the sun, and it's nowhere near another massive planet that could keep it warm with the gravity. So we are really lost. We don't understand how Pluto could be so active. So in fact, the coolest thing about Pluto is why it's warm. All right, next. Let's see. Ooh, next question. Why does Pluto intrigue us so much? Maybe because it's the farthest body out there that used to be a planet, but not anymore. Sorry, Pluto. But also, it's, it's kind of the underdog of the solar system, isn't it? It's had this interesting history where we don't know that much about it, and everybody loves a mystery. Before New Horizons, I mean, we had, you know, five pixels across of a Hubble image of Pluto. We could see very little of its surface. We didn't know what was there. Pluto is the newest planet. We just saw it up close for the first time. That hasn't happened in a long time. We haven't been this excited since the days of Voyager. Finally, we had a concerted effort to send a probe there, and it took, you know, a decade to get there. And then when we see it, it completely blew our expectations. That's a whole world there with mountain ranges, with frozen seas, just covered in ices, rocks, things that we had never even expected. No one expected Pluto to look like that. You know, everyone had their, their guesses, but of course, nature is always more interesting than our imaginations.